always it's go one night out today everybody this is Jordan Jones I'm welcoming you back to the Republic of Jordan and my playthrough of Super Mario Galaxy 2 for the Nintendo Wii if you guys can give me a favor and click on that like button I would really appreciate that no matter what device you're watching my video on on YouTube just smack that like button for me because I would appreciate that big time because this place has been awesome. So, let me know down in the comments below for question of the video. Um, um, question of the video. Um, What well, hub world do you prefer more? The, uh, the Comet Observatory in Galaxy 1? Or this spaceship, Mario, in Galaxy 2? I'd love to know in the comments below. Or just, rather it could be, do you prefer the Comet Observatory in Galaxy 1? Or the spaceship, Mario, in Galaxy 2? Just let me know down in the comments below for question of the video. I might not be able to respond to everything, but still, I'll try to respond as much as I can if you do. So, the second and third green stars, Cosmic Cove Galaxy, are a little tricky to get, but the, they're not difficult by any means, but they're just trickier than that first one. They're just a little bit tricky to get. But, they, but they're still relatively easy. If you know the right placement. I can't get over how amazing Galaxy and Galaxy 2 loves are. I can't get over how amazing the Galaxy games are. You know, I've only had some more Galaxy 2 since my birthday last year. Um, I can't get over how amazing Galaxy 2 is. And I can't get over how amazing the first Galaxy game is either. Because I love Galaxy so much. Look at this. Isn't this amazing or what? This is so magical. So awesome. I just love the Galaxy games. They're the two best Mario games on planet Earth. I can't even stress enough how amazing they are. They're like everything right, everything perfect, everything the way you want it. Not that like anything wrong with them is what I can think of. Okay, I'm gonna just farm the star bit. I really, I really memorize the green star even, so I'm just gonna uh, just look around and just explore a little bit. Come on, I don't want to hop in the water like that. I want to dive into it. Dive into the water. That's how we like going there. And we're gonna need to get more air. You can collect a coin to get more air, or you can um, go to the air bubble to get more air. I think. Keep in mind, you can do an extra swim boost if you shake your wheel up. Just like you can in the original Super Mario Galaxy game. It's hard to believe how amazing the Galaxy games look on my on my smart TV. Because this TV is so amazing. These should be your first two games you should buy for your Wii. Should be the Galaxy games. Alright, so what we gotta do is we're just gonna keep going to go into this part like normal. Because there ain't no green star underwater where we get it. <clears throat> So, we're in the 2D section now. I think this is the section where the green star is, but I don't know for sure. I'm going this way just to check. I see it. I see it. Oh my gosh. It's a green star. This one's kind of a tricky one to get. It's not 
difficult. It's not difficult by any, it's not difficult by any means. It's just tedious and tricky. It can't. That's why I don't. That's why this one's kind of annoying to get in a way. But we can probably do the home and ground thing. Um, Well, that works. <laughs> I didn't even do the homing ground pound because I didn't even know how far it did. I could have done the homing ground pound. That probably would have honed on to it, but that worked at least. Got the same green star at Cosmic Cove Galaxy. It was tedious to get as well, but very easy. Um, it was a little. It's probably. The, I think it's the third one that's tricky to get. That might be the tricky one. Might be the third one. Now we're going to do the third green star of Cosmic Cove Galaxy. Well, the Cosmic Cove Galaxy is my all-time favorite galaxy in this game. It's just so relaxing, so magical. Excuse me. I love the green stars so much in this game because the green stars are so much fun to find in this game. And I enjoy finding the green stars. I actually enjoy the green stars even more than I do the actual game. Because they're like, you're going on the Easter egg hunt. I remember doing Easter egg hunts when I was little. I don't do them no more. I remember the trick or treat night today over Halloween. I don't know, Halloween night to do trick or treat, and that was so much fun while I was little. I don't trick or treat no more because I'm 18 years old now, and I'll be 19 in October. Because my, my birthday is October 21st, and I, I was born in the year 2002. Of course. Alright, so. Look at this. Look at this. Look how pretty this is. This is pretty. This is pretty. Look how beautiful this is. This is beautiful. This is like the best water level ever in the any Mario game. It's like the best water level. No other water level tops how amazing this water level is. Especially on my HD TV, which is on my smart TV I have. It looks amazing. And it's so fun to swim through. And you can swim through it. It is so easy. Huh? It's so predictable. Uh, everything's, it's just everything right. Everything perfect. <clears throat> I'm glad we got the second green star on the first try because I thought that would be the trickiest one to get. Because it kind of is for me the trickiest. The third green star, I'm not 100% sure where it's at, but we can figure out pretty easily. It won't be no problem. This one won't be a problem. Where is the last green star? I don't even know where it's at, but I do know how to get it. I know how to get it whenever I do find it. I'm just not positive where it's at. Thank come on Mario, get on the ledge like that. Thank you. Is there is it around here? Oh, I see it now. I see the sparkle of it. So, what I do to get it? I kind of want to grab that key so that I don't have to grab a key animation while I try to get it. <clears throat> I think now I can just run and long jump. stars are way easier than the regular mission. I thought these green stars are really easy because they aren't that difficult. Like, I know a lot of people are like, those are so hard and stuff like that, but they're not that difficult. I don't even think they're that difficult, but 
Okay, so now we're doing Wild Glad Galaxy, and then after that we'll do the one in the middle. And then after that we'll do the Castle of World 2, and that will wrap World 2's green stars. The majority of these green stars aren't that difficult, I just noticed that. Mm -hmm. Okay, the first green star of Wild Glad Galaxy. I don't see it, but we can... Can I look at it to see where it's at? I guess we'll have to start flying first. And I really don't know for sure where it's at, but I do know we can find it. I do know we can figure it out. Yeah, we can definitely figure it out pretty easily. Uh, Oh, it's right here. I do remember now. That was really easy. That's the first green star to say. I do remember now. My reaction time was fast enough because I did not even memorize what was up. Because I can't memorize every single green star, but. <laughs> Let's do one more. Can we have enough time for one more? Especially if we can do it in one try. I really enjoy these green stars. Because I know this level's easy, and we already got the first green star out of the way. We can do the same thing, almost the same thing, get to the second green star. Yes. All right, now, so we're gonna go for her. So this is erect controls, keep in mind, this is erect controls. So keep in mind, okay, the first green star is down there, and that one was very easy. I think the second one's also pretty easy to get. Pretty easy, but, I mean, it's not that hard, but it can be a little bit tricky. It can be a little tricky, but I don't think it's going to be that hard. It's probably not going to be that hard. Probably not. I think we'll do pretty good at it. We're just going to take our time, because I'm not in any hurry. I missed it. I'm gonna cut to where I get it. All right, I'm back. Wow, it only took two tries to get that. Not too be surprised, but that's not that hard. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you very much for watching guys and have a good one. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.